I am super excited to bring to you our next story. These guys are creating some of the most unique beers in Croatia. I'd like to introduce you to Nova Runda Craft Brewery. I'm Jeff. I just retired from the military, sold everything I own, and now I'm traveling around the world to learn from brewers, winemakers, distillers, and tell their story. This is my journey of beer, wine, and spirits. During our college days, one year we had a trip to the Czech Republic and it really was such a blast. Yeah. So after we came to Croatia, we were drinking beer and we said, ah, this sucks, you know. <laughs> we, did, we don't have any good beer here. We should open a brewer. Then he said, <laughs> uh, well, well, just uh, slow down and let's try to brew a beer first. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> his idea was let's start a brewery. Yeah. And I said, okay, we'll slow down. Let's see if uh, there's some, someone in Croatia maybe who started already to brew beer. We found that uh, it was, there was a web page, it was a forum called uh, brewing.info. There was the, the major portal of home brewers in Croatia. And all five of them. <laughs> <laughs> in that time. Yeah, wow. in that time. And this time you're talking about what? what 2009, 2009, 2009. 2009. 2009. So we were so. No. Yeah. It was not like in the States when Homer yeah. was. Talk to me about the name. No. Okay. Okay. His wow. idea was to start the business. I was, you know, more satisfied with my day job working, home brewing. I was really satisfied with home brewing. He, he was pushing, you know, let's do it now, let's do it now. And, and uh, I had also a really good job. <laughs> but I, I had a really good job, but I hated it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really get my job at that point. Yeah. And he said, we will open it <laughs> with a name or without it. I said, no, we need a name in Croatian language mm. because we will be based on our audience and yeah. if everyone from outside of Croatia don't like our name. I mean, he will have to learn yeah. what that means in our language. And now, no good thing is we have our Croatian name for the brewery and all, all of our beers are in English. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, but the uh, crowd beer scene is used to uh, yeah. English names. Yeah. And that's a better way. No, Runda means uh, when you order a beer in Croatia, but not the first one, when you order the second, third, you said, uh, Nova Runda. Yeah. <laughs> Give me Nova Runda. Yeah. Uh, that like, means another round. Another round. But or in Croatian language that also had a second meaning that means a new round. So when you Google Nova Runda you will get new round of negotiations. With countries. Fresh or... start, new start. So that was symbolic because we were first brewery that brewed American Pale Ale style of the beer or any craft beer style in Especially Croatia. ales. During yeah. that time Croatia was heavily influenced by lagers, Czech and German brewing schools and there were no ales here. Our friends in the UK, they are also, they cannot believe us when we tell them that we started the revolution with ale type of beer. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you, guys, yeah you guys started that. Yeah, we were yeah. the first with that beer. First, yeah. It's funny because the demand for your beer, I mean, especially around in this area and in Croatia, is has risen. You know, and I, I hear people on the streets saying, "Man, you know, uh, if you could sell it in bottles, you know, and you know, we'd, we'd buy that. You guys would make a lot more money doing bottles. You guys know that, but you guys stick to cakes." We started this whole business because we like uh, homebrew, we like beers, and we wanted to give the to market uh, really the freshest beer possible. And that's the keg beer, draft beer. That's the reason. And especially since we are based on uh, American type of beers, American styles, so we are really hopheads. Those beers should be poured fresh. Yeah. And there's no better way than keg. You guys almost created, like like we were talking about before, like a cult following, basically because you're, the way you sell it is in certain bars. You actually almost gotta, you know, kind of find it or find where where Nova Rune is at. So was that part of the marketing strategy too? Or back then we also said in five years probably the market will be totally different. And I think the good customer care and really unique type of business yeah. will stand up among others. Yeah. And that's what we did with uh, keg beers. What does the future hold for Nova Runda? You guys have some pretty good plans good on plans. the horizon. We are working to move to a bigger brewer. Yeah. And we'll see how that will go. But that's our definite goal to have our own brewery to get 
all the process in our hands, you know, to have everything to work uh, in a much better way than we have work here now. This time next year, <laughs> we'll be in a new brewery. Awesome, guys. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers yeah, definitely. I love what you guys are doing here in Croatia, man, really pushing the boundaries on, on craft beer. And thank you guys for your hospitality. With that, everybody knows my tradition. This one's from Hoften Dormo. It's basically a chocolate beer. They're a true farmhouse style. They really grow their ingredients on the farm and right to the brew. This one's from uh, T. Verzette, and it's an Oud Brun vineyard. They're making some absolutely fantastic beer. You guys will absolutely love it. Thank guys, you very much, Jeff. Yeah, thank, thank you, you guys. Appreciate it.